this is Hans, and it's time for another episode of Instant Noodle Recipe Time. This is the show where I show you what to do with your instant noodles. And boy, it's been, what? Last review I did was March 13th, and now it's March 27th. So it's been a little while, and a lot of new stuff has shown up, like this. This is from, I don't know what the brand of this, what the range is called. It just says various types of noodles on it. And they, but the company pushing this is Noodle Mix. And this is a Chinese sesame oil and lion's mane mushroom noodle soup made with pumpkin infused konjac noodle from Taiwan. That's a mouthful. Yeah, I'm, I'm like, wow. Here, is the konjac noodle. So konjac is a root, I believe, and it uh, it's basically like practically like zero calories. There's like really nothing to it as far as your system is concerned. And this is only gonna take a minute and a half to cook. At first I had some confusion as to whether it had broth, however, Oh, it goes that far down, okay. However, I saw some pictures of it prepared and indeed it do have broth. So that's good to know. And this, let's see. The trick with konjac noodle is the gauge. If it's not like a really, a really, really light gauge, it doesn't work. And honestly, that's what this kind of appears to be is a light gauge noodle. This is the, the mushrooms, and it says, you know, they're, you could eat them straight out of there right now if you wanted to, but it, it mentions warming them up first, so I'm gonna let them take a little ride with it. And I'm gonna add this, this must be the Chinese sesame oil. So there is that. So, what have I been doing in the last, uh, what, hold up, two weeks? I've been walking and I've been doing my diet and I've been keeping it around 1200 calories a day and doing at least 10 miles a day. In fact, this is the 31st day in a row of doing 10 miles a day of walking. And on Friday, I did 18 miles and I've been paying for it every day since. That was a little much, but I don't know. It felt good. It was fun. And now I'm like sore. There's also allergies about. It's that season. So, yeah. I want this to get to a bit more of a roll. Come on. <coughs> That's done. I'll let it get a little more rolling. Come on. Let's get up to a boil. It mentions one of the aspects of konjac noodle is you can't overcook them. Which I thought was interesting. But something I, I can't complain about. But we will move. There we go. That should do it. Smells pretty good. Let's have a look see. So this is the konjac noodle. Kind of a thick-ish gauge. Broth smells very good. But the question is, is how chewy are these? Are these gonna be rubber bands or not? No, not so much. A broth. It smells really good. It's got a sweetness to it. Damn, that's hot.
Why is it so hot? I don't know. It's nice. It almost reminds me of like duck. Like the flavor of a, a duck noodle. It's, it's got that mustiness, that savory. Oh, come on. Let go of. Oh. Jeez. Hold on. Like I said, it's been a while, and it is like all this, all these cords that are now over here. There we go. There we go. Lady, eh, channel. Yeah, for konjac noodle, I, I do like this. And it says it's a pumpkin konjac noodle. We will see. All the dogs in the neighborhood are barking for some reason. Give this the old comb over. I haven't, I really haven't made noodles in like two weeks. That's a while. Uh, on the 14th was my birthday. Thank you for all the birthday wishes. I don't know, just really wasn't in my birthday this year, but it ended up going really well. I also, I, I ended up getting some really nice gifts. I got uh, Amazon gift cards. Thank you. And it's like, I got what I really wanted, which was a new game box for the uh, arcade machine. That's what I really, really wanted. And I got that. And then I had these, these gift cards. Oh wow, here's the mushrooms. Lion's Mane Mushroom. Almost like chunks of meat, I gotta say. It looks like chunks of meat, but I don't think it is. Come on, show show off, be a show off. There's other ones that they, they sent me a big box of different varieties of these konjac noodles. I'm gonna try this. I can't imagine this is like highly caloric. Mushroom. Really? That is absolutely the meatiest mushroom I have ever tried, ladies and gentlemen. Chewy as can be. Yeah. <laughs> I I would I would say that's like Interesting, interesting. Since it's sesame, uh, Chinese sesame and mushroom. A little sesame seed. I really don't know what else to do to this. Honestly. This is pretty amazing stuff. For konjac, this is probably, gosh, I'd say about the best. Oh, there was one from Indonesia that was my absolute all-time favorite konjac kun noodle. Let's see. Here, let's just stand up. Why not? Here we go. Well, cool. That's the first one I've tried of uh, 
the noodle mix varieties. Thank you very much for sending them. These are, those are, wow. If that's the first step in a journey of their products, sorry, I, 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 I'm not just definitely on a time constraint today. So that's the first one to try from them. I can only guess that the rest are going to be really quite good. So if you want to get a good konjak noodle, that's it. That's, wow. Uh, the next one we have is U.S. variety made in Thailand. It's Thai kitchen garlic and vegetable. And I had this literally, what, 12 years ago in 2011. So we'll see how it fares. And this has been Hans the Ramen Raider wishing you enjoyment of your noodles each and every day. Have a good one and bye.